fellas, we are officially getting Frosty Fest underway. Just like in Splatoon 2, we're having Frosty Fest in January. This Splatfest is evil because it's one of the hardest to pick a team for, for myself at least. But I got a few tricks up my sleeve to help you overcome and convince others to join us on Team Friend. I mean, come on, come on, look at how cute the artwork is. It, it, it's cute for all three teams, but the little, the little party, the little party with the Inklings and the Octolings. <laughs> Don't you want to party with us? Yeah, yeah, you do. <laughs> Cue Splatfest. You're looking to play some games. You get to choose between playing with your friends who love Splatoon, your family who may or may not have much experience, or spin the wheel of solo queue. Oh boy! <laughs> Fellas, we have the upper hand. Coordinate your gear and get all that lovely clout with your friends during the Splatfest. If everyone is your friend, we, we could have the first Splatfest where everyone is on the same team. After all, that's totally what happened the first time we had the Family vs. Friends Splatfest. Ahaha! It's okay, it's okay, this is take two. Here's an example of my family not even wanting to coordinate with me anyway. Clearly another reason to pick team friends. Please, come up the stairs. You don't want to be down there. Oh, you want to come upstairs so bad. You want to come upstairs so bad. Oh yes, you wanna come up, you wanna come upstairs. Oh, the door. The door. <laughs> the door. You wanna, you wanna come up towards the door? Oh yeah, you do. Yes, you do, yes, yes. Yes, look, it's right. It's right there. It's right there. You know, you wanna, oh, you wanna go up the stair. Let's just, let's just do more. Oh, you're so talented, you're so talented at stairs, yes. Second of all, this blue is such a different color from the yellow and the white. It reminds me of like lightly frosted glass that you'd see on an ornament. I love that. Your eyes will be trained like a hawk to fight anything that isn't periwinkle blue-ish. I want that blue on my inkling like now. <laughs> I mean, hey, hey, I've only won two Splatfests and both of them were with the purpliest color available. So if you ask me, I'm setting myself up for success. <laughs> come on, come on, just, just ask people you know who they're gonna play with. If they say they're gonna play with their friends, you can begin to chuckle, yes. Honestly, I just wanna be on the same team as last time win or lose last time that i tried ditching my choice from a previous splatfest it didn't go too well i was on team money in splatoon 2 and we lost so i joined team love in splatoon 3 and um um uh we we can fight to make this a win grab your fellow friends and start planning the downfall of your foes now the way we stay ahead is by playing Turf War together before the fest to become the best. Yes. And find a special friend to grind tricolor Turf War with ASAP too. So we all know how much it can tip the scales. I like hanging out with family. I like sitting around and doing nothing and maybe even doing some editing. <laughs> I like hanging out with my friends and partying it up. But at this very moment, my friends and I are planning a Christmas New Year's combo bash party to bring in the new year. So, um, I think I've got my bias sorted out. <laughs> There's nothing more I love doing in Splatoon than playing with friends for a couple of hours, whether it's playing the main game or in Salmon Run. And it's our job on Team Friends to steal more players slash friends for our side. So go, go, go. Enjoy Splatfest and happy holidays. We also get that fun masquerade party gear for Splatfest 2, which makes it even more memorable. Even if the festive party cone isn't among the options, I'll still manifest her to come back. Let me know what team you're picking and why in the comments. I mean, obviously it'll all be a team friend because you wouldn't click on this video if you weren't on team friend, right? Right. <laughs>